One thing that you'll see in all the brainstem models is a part of the cerebrum, part of the cerebral hemispheres. This is a part of the cerebral hemispheres that fuses with the diencephalon. And as the cerebrum develops in humans, it becomes hidden by expanding parts of the cerebrum. So in order to see the insula, which is what this is, this is the insula, in order to see the insula on an intact brain, you would have to go into the lateral fissure and separate the temporal and the frontal lobes from one another, and then you'll be able to see this. So what you're seeing here is the cut surface of the cerebrum as the surrounding cerebrum has been removed so that you can see this brain stem and you can also now see the insula. So this is part of the cerebral cortex called the insula. Here is a different view of this model. On either side you can again see the insula of each cerebral hemisphere. Right over here this is, represents the top of the corpus callosum which we'll see from a different angle. And this translucent plastic material that you see right over here represents the interior of the lateral ventricles. The lateral ventricles are internal chambers within the cerebral hemispheres which are filled with cerebrospinal fluid. So the clearness of this plastic represents the fact that this would be a fluid filled space. Here is another angle of uh, the insula and here is you can see the cut surface of the corpus callosum. You would have here in the corpus callosum fibers that are crossing from one side to the other. Uh, right over here you have the genu of the corpus callosum and right back over here you have the splenium of the corpus callosum.